Yo, so Wes right here. I'm up here in North Georgia at my cousin's wedding and I have the honor and privilege of being one of his groomsmen. And I'm super excited for him and super proud of him for him and his bride to be here. And I was thinking though this morning, what are some simple things for my single people? What are some practical things you can look for when you're choosing a mate and you can look for in yourself to prepare? Well, I came up with five things. And you may say, Wes, I don't care about anything you gotta say. Take what you want and you can leave the rest. But here's what I believe on my heart. I'm gonna start from the bottom of the list and go to the top. So number five, are you attracted to them? Something very simple. I know we don't wanna make all these religious games out of it and all these things. Oh, I don't wanna be considered shallow. But really, are you attracted to them? Remember, beauty is in the eye of the beholder. So that's gonna be different for everybody. Number four, do you get along with them? Now, if you got all this stress, all this drama, you're fighting all the time, you're feeling this way all the time about them, and you can't ever see eye to eye, then maybe you might want to consider somebody else. Number three, do they have character? And do you have character? Now, what I mean by that is not perfection, not somebody that's flawless, because you're never going to arrive there yourself, but also they may not arrive there themselves. So you're wanting to look at someone you can grow with in there. But what I mean by character is how they treat you. Are they going to love you? Are they going to get past being selfish and self-centered and be able to pour into your life just like you would be able to do with them? So really the big thing is how they treat you. Can they love you? Can they get past being self-centered? And same for you. Number two, do they fit what you were put on this earth to do? I'm not trying to get all spiritual and deep with this. I mean, do they fit the purpose and direction you're going in life? And do you? That's a really big one. That was number two, I said. And number one, the ultimate thing, it's not about you having it all together and being perfect or the other individual. It's about trusting God. Very simple. Do you trust God with your heart? Do you trust God with your future? Do you trust God that he has already got everything taken care of? And that's what it's really all about. Do you trust him? So, like I said, right here, five things. Take what you want out of them. You can leave the rest, whatever you want to do. But I'm super excited. I'm going to go enjoy this wedding now. And it's an honor to be there. And peace out.